Today, I'm excited to share a project that brings together security, safety, and technology the vehicle monitoring system. This system monitors real-time data like temperature, humidity, speed, location, and more. It even detects if the driver is intoxicated. All this data is sent to the cloud for remote monitoring. Let's dive in and build this step by step. Here's what I used for this project. A ESP32, it is a 32-bit microcontroller, supports both Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. A GPS module to track vehicle location and speed. Connect the module to the ESP32 using UART. The RX pin of the GPS connects to GPIO1 of the ESP32 and the TX pin connects to GPIO3. A SIM 800 LGSM module also uses UART. Connect its TX and RX pins to another UART port on the microcontroller, such as GPIO16 and GPIO17. For the temperature and humidity sensor, I used DHT11. Connect its data pin to GPIO pin 4 on the microcontroller. An alcohol sensor to detect if the driver is drunk or not. Connect alcohol sensor to GPIO ADC pin 34 for analog input. For the accelerometer sensor, I used ADXL335. Use GPIO ADC pins 33, 36, and 39 for get X, Y, and Z axis value to detect vehicle movement. Finally, a LCD display for the driver to see data and warning. It is connected via I2C using GPIO21 with SDA and GPIO22 with SCL. Now, let's write the code. Open the Arduino IDE and install the following libraries. Blink for cloud connectivity. Tiny GPS Plus for GPS data parsing. DHT sensor library for temperature and humidity readings. Liquid Crystal I2C for the LCD display. Here's the step-by-step -step code. First define Blink template ID, template name and authentication code. Include all library. Initialize the UART ports for GPS and GSM modules. Define Wi-Fi SSID and password to connect it with Wi-Fi and establish an HTTPS connection with the Blink server. Set up variables to store data. Create a timer for update data to Blink server in specific intervals. Store GPIO 13 boolean value to switch 1 to make an emergency call by pressing the switch. And second switch GPIO 12 to control LCD state. And this is for location speed and time. As we get time respect to GMT0, I add 5 hour and 30 minutes as our time zone. Also for time correction, I add a condition. If minutes is greater than or equal to 60, then subtract 60 from minutes and add 1 to hour. Same did with hour. If hours is greater than or equal to 24, then subtract 24 from hour and add 1 to the date. And if alcohol sensor value exceeding a threshold level, then it send alert to mobile by Blink app and SMS to owner with location and other's data. And that's how you build a vehicle monitoring system with real-time tracking and alerts. This system is perfect for improving vehicle security and ensuring safety.